Hi everyone, my name is Christina. Welcome to my channel, Art Made Whole. And um, right now I'm working on a piece called Communion. I'm doing it actually for school. I take a painting class uh, right now. And um, I just figured why not just record my process. So it's halfway done. <laughs> um, and I had the footage in the beginning, but I, I lost half the footage. For some reason, when I transferred it to Dropbox, uh, all the, the videos were converted to JPEGs. So I must have done something wrong in the process. I don't know if anybody else has ever experienced that. <laughs> um, and then I deleted them on iCloud before I found out. So they were completely gone. So uh, now I'm, trying, I'm starting over. <laughs> now I'm starting over. And uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoy. So before I get started, I just wanted to show you uh, what I'm using to paint. Um, I'm using titanium white. Um, this is a acrylic painting, so I'm using titanium white uh, from Blick Artist. This is series one. Um, raw umber. Um, yellow ochre. Let's see that a little bit better. Yellow ochre. And this is how you say it from Utrecht. Uh, Venetian red. I use very, very little because my teacher said that Venetian red swallows everything up. I have my palette knife uh, and this is a still life painting. So I have the towel um, representing uh, what Jesus used when he washed the disciples' feet, um, the cup, and the bread. And here's my um, <laughs> jar. <laughs> here's my jar of water. So I, as you can see, I only started with the cup, um, so I had to do the the plate and yeah. Um, I have this little small studio, this this space actually it's just literally a corner because it's the only room in the house where uh, my toddler, who I love so much, who is energetic and bubbly and has such a personality, she doesn't go in. Uh, so it's a safe place for safe space for me to paint. And I know that she's not going to take the paint and, you know, <laughs> take my brushes and paint over my stuff because she has before.
so if we have it yes that's a Febreze assignment that I had to do for household items <laughs> So I'm finally done. It's nighttime right now. Um, but yeah, I'm glad it worked out. And I wasn't sure. The, it's my first time painting um, cloth and matzah. <laughs> so I hope that it, it ended up looking okay. Um, but I think it turned out okay. And uh, I have to get it done anyway because it's a homework assignment for school. And I just want to submit it as soon as possible. So um, I hope that you enjoyed this video and I'll be posting more content in the future. Uh, I'm gonna try to get paintings out every week. I'm still practicing, I'm still learning. Uh, and one of the things I learned actually, just wanted to share, um, I realized when I was painting it, sometimes I usually, you know, to kind of set the mood, I put on my instrumental piano worship music and I just kind of paint because it kind of helps me to focus and I, I realized that that night um, of uh, basically when they were celebrating Passover with Jesus, the night of his betrayal, the night of his suffering, um, when things started to commence toward him going uh, to the cross, was that, you know, he, he took the role as a servant and it was so surprising to his disciples. Right, they were they were confused. They were shocked. Peter didn't want him to uh, to wash his feet. Uh, he Jesus had to explain why, but also that even what he was doing in that moment, um, that was that was a fulfillment of prophecy because in Isaiah fifty three, I believe I corrected it in the, in the future if it's not correct, but Isaiah fifty three, you know that chapter. I remember it's called the suffering servant. So he, he was that suffering servant. He was the servant that was about to suffer and go on the cross and die for our sins. And when I was painting the towel, I was like, oh my God, the towel is so dirty. It looks so dirty, but you know, the it would have been dirty. You know, <laughs> it would have been dirty washing all the disciples' feet. And you know, when I look at this towel, of course, no one would ever put a dirty towel next to uh, on the dinner table. You know next to, to their meal but when i was looking at this towel i was like wow you know jesus took our sins you know that dirty towel those dirty rags and he took that you know so um and i i liked how everything kind of was connected in this painting the towel with the 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 bread and the and the cup so yeah i just want to share that with you and um again i thank you for <laughs> for joining me and i hope to see you next time and if you like this video like and subscribe bye